Yo, what's up guys, True here with another video. So, right now, I'm going to the 240 to see if we can figure out this freaking problem because, boy oh boy, it's getting freaking annoying where I can't drive it. So, let's go to the car. Boom, so we're at the 240 and, man, this is getting so depressing where I can't even freaking figure out the problem. So, today's game plan is to take out the alternator, go to the store, test it out and see if the alternator is okay. Hopefully it's okay because if it's not okay, then I have to order another one and it's gonna take a day just to get there. So uh, let me pop up the hood. So I have to take out the battery again. I gotta take out my intake and a couple hoses, which is only two. And that way I can get to the alternator, unbolt the alternator, go to all the auto parts store and get it tested. And I'm actually hoping that it tests bad. That way they can give me a new one. And when I put the new one in, uh hopefully the battery light goes off if not i did get a comment uh on my last video saying that i should just bulk up the uh power cable for the alternator and bulk up the ground cable for the alternator as well uh get like thicker wire that way uh we wouldn't have this problem but uh, i'm just gonna go test the alternator because it's a free test and that way they're gonna tell me if it's good or bad. So uh, let's get to it. So we got the alternator out. Now it's time for us to go to the auto parts store and see if the alternator is okay. Like I said before, I hope it's bad. That way I can just swap it out, put a new one in, and hopefully the battery light turns off. So uh, let's get going. All right, so I'm back from the store and I kind of didn't want to record myself driving because the sun was like, like I was driving towards the sunset and I couldn't see and I don't want to get into a freaking accident. So don't do that. Don't vlog while driving with sunset because yeah, you can't you can't see anything. So I was just like, you know what, freak that. But the alternator did pass and I was hoping that the alternator failed. That way I can get a new uh new alternator and just slap it on. But unfortunately it passed, so wow. Now we gotta slap the alternator back. But I actually bought some new uh, terminals for it. Uh, this is gonna go to the power of the alternator and hopefully that solves the problem because I actually have like a butt connector for like a stereo. So I'm guessing it's not really getting good connection. So that's why I bought it. So let's put everything back and switch out that radio butt connector with these uh, beefy uh, battery cable plugs or whatever. So let's get to it. I forgot to mention that it gets really dark because of the freaking hill behind me. So we're gonna go to the next day. So let's go ahead and put that new terminal that we bought from AutoZone and hopefully the battery light turns off. So I put everything back. I put the battery back, mounted it down, put my uh, power and ground, put the alternator back with the belt, tensioned the belt. And if we go back inside the car, big mess in here but we're back in the car crew what's up guys so back in the car go ahead and put on the on position fans are on and I'm just gonna zoom in just a little bit all right here we go one two three still have the same symptom what so the plan is to take the car to an auto parts store have their machine test out the alternator and battery and hopefully everything turns out fine i do have to check recheck my wires one more time i'm gonna have to you know slice everything and make sure everything's fine there's no wires uh hitting you know touching metal or something that causing a short that way when the car is starting the alternator is not giving charge to the battery so it's just a lot of stuff that I have to go through and it's it's so frustrating but hopefully uh, we can get this car running in tip-top shape that's gonna wrap up today's video hopefully you guys enjoyed it please like share and subscribe and don't forget to hit that notification bell because I am gonna start pumping up a lot more videos and my goal is to hit 5k subscribers at the end of this year and the only way I can do it is by your guys's help and I really appreciate you guys watching my videos and you know 
commenting and liking my videos so it means a lot guys like for real it means so much but like always i'll see you guys on the next video later guys